tragedy in a small southern Utah town. We continue to follow the murder-suicide that left three adults and five children dead. Their bodies were found inside an Enacomb yesterday afternoon, and that's where we find Fox 13 News reporter Jenna Bree tonight. She li joins us live. Jenna, what can you tell us about this investigation so far? Bob and Kelly police believe a man shot and killed his seven family members before taking his own life at this home on the 4900 North Block of Albert Drive. There's no timeline on when the family was killed, but the Enoch City Mayor says witnesses saw members of the family at a church activity on Tuesday night. The three adults were identified as Michael and Tasha Haight, Tasha's mother, Gail Earl, and five children who were not identified by name, but range in ages from four to six. 17 years old. After being married for nearly 20 years, court records show 40 year old Tasha Haight filed for divorce on December 21st in Iron County. In a briefing today, Enoch City Manager Rob Dotson said authorities received a call Wednesday that Tasha had missed a previously scheduled appointment, and that's why police made the welfare check yesterday afternoon. A few hours after that welfare check call came in and, and Tasha was not located. A missing persons report was um, requested and, um, t and uh, was received by Cedar City Police Department due to Michael's office location in Cedar City. Once determined Michael's home address was in Enoch City, the missing persons report was passed to Enoch City officers, at which point um, the welfare check to locate Tasha became an effort to find the entire family. Michael Haight was listed as an Allstate insurance agent with an office in Cedar City, but a family friend told Fox 13 News that the 42-year-old had left the company within the last week. Dotson says the bodies have been removed from the home and autopsies will be performed within the next coming days. Reporting live in Enoch, Jenna Bree, Fox 13 News, Utah.